Hey, what's happening, guys? This is Tiro back with another video. Hope you guys are doing well. And this video will be a different one. I mean, if you are a pro Android user, then this video is not for you. You can watch some other videos from my channel, which will be linked in the card right here. If you are someone who is like a light Android user or you are an older person who just new to Android, then this video is for you. I did one more tips and tricks video on Android like a year ago. If you want to see that, here is a card for that. Today in this video, I am going to show you how to manage your storage when it shows insufficient internal storage or something like that or some error like that. So without further delay, let's make it happen. This storage space running out notification keeps coming in your phone and it's annoying because you can't even update app from play store, right? Well, bear with me, I got you covered. You do not need to worry anymore. Well, first of all, go to your file explorer, then storage, then from the top left, select internal storage. You see this folder named Android. Don't do anything to this folder, just let it be as it is. You can manage other folders except this Android folder. Well, if you have a SD card, then move every other thing inside of internal storage to SD card. I mean from this DCIM folder is where your photos and videos are. Move them to your SD card. Well, in case you don't have a SD card, just back it up to your PC and delete them from your phone. And you see this WhatsApp folder, most of the time too much junk stays there. So just go inside the media folder, then delete or move them one by one. In music, obviously there are music move them to conclusion you can delete or move pretty much all the stuff except the folder named android but do not expect the internal storage to be just freed up all the way because it's where your system is so it can't be emptied totally. Once you are done moving stuff, then go to settings, then storage. Here you will find something called cache data. Click on it. Now hit OK and done. You can do this clearing cache thing in once in a month. One more thing, do not install apps like Clean Master, Battery Saver or something like that because Android is much more optimized than you think and it's well capable of managing the battery life itself and those apps always ends up draining more battery so that's that. So that wraps up this video guys. If this video helped you, give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to the channel right here. And this is Tato signing off. I'll see you soon. Bye bye now. Nice cootie though.